What you are about to see is a demonstration of volunteers that want to exercise their faith based on the preaching of the indigenous people of Biafran just to say no to the Janja weed and to say no to all the things that has been committed, the mayhem they've been committing against the indigenous people of Biafra. And today, the volunteers here in this very city has taken the guru by the horn to make sure that um, they make their way open to the whole world to say that indeed they are in tune with what is going on here in Biafra land. And this evening, they are in a very strong signal to say no more to Ribbon, no more to the cattle rearers taking over our land, raping our mothers and killing our sisters. It is no more, says Ohamadike and also to all Biafrans all over the world. This all you see here, they are all volunteers. They have contributed to make sure that this is done. It's a wonderful evangelism as you can see. And that is exactly what is going on today. They are here to base their faith alongside with the indigenous people of Biafra and the supreme the magazine in the canal they are moving forward to face the banner if you look at the description on the banner you find out that in their middle they want to let the world know enough is enough enough of this in biafran land that is exactly what you are saying. That is exactly what is going on. That is exactly what is going on. From now to 14th is the D-Day to tell all the Fulanese that occupied our land to leave. The main business is to let them know that we are no longer comfortable with them. Our job is to ask them to leave, whether they like it or not. It's just for them to leave because they are not contributing in any way. The job they do is to know how to make him kill and split blood in Biafran land. That is the fate of what you can see today. at is the what people decide to do on their own they just volunteered to put this inscription they went and contributed money and raised a very big banner the story is that the full and innocent have killed a lot of people in Biafran land 
and they are together saying with our leader Mazin and the Karo, that is enough is enough that they do not want to patronize the full and nearest men in our garden in our farms and in our home they will split a lot of blood and they want to make sure that this is the end of it
themselves print a very big banner to place it here in one of the major city and in the scripture written no more full any heads men in the Afran land no more open grazing bill as you can see that is what is causing this order of here this wonderful place.
just want you to wait patiently and see what is going on here. I just want you to wait patiently and see what is going on here. These ones are formidable. On their own, they contributed money and raised up Anna. They raised up Anna. These are free association readers. Yeah. They always gather that this uh, paper stand to look at the current news and what Mazin Nandi Khan have said. And I know they heard him when he said, no more grazing land, no more Fulanese in Biafran land. And they went ahead to use their money to put up this banner. This is where they congregate to go through newspapers and to do the needful. That is exactly what they are doing today. I just want you to be patient with them. They are going to raise up this banner. So the banner has been lifted up. The banner has been lifted up. The banner has been lifted up. We are calling on EU, US, some other country to know that open raising is against even the law that is not in, in Nigeria. The direction has been set, the best has been set by the Supreme Leader of the Indigenous People of Biafra. No more cattle, no more cattle railway, walking all the street. We are the true citizens of the land. Can you see that? That's exactly what is going on here today. This work is put together by Free Readers Association here in one of the biggest cities in Biafran land. They want to do this to support the gospel of restoration of the sovereign nation of Biafra. That is exactly what is going on here today. That is exactly what is going on here today. Keep sharing this video and let others emulate from this free gesture. This kind of action that they all that and spend the money to promote voice and the walls of our supremely massive Nandi Okado.
can see a lot of crowd looking at this b-board what is behind this b-board here some other people corresponding to exactly what is going on here today. Well done, sir. Yeah. You're welcome. I was just passing and I find that the crowd was so much. And I noticed descriptions on the banner that you put just placed here. Yes. What is the purpose of this? Yeah, my name is Ike Uwezoke. And uh, what we are doing here today with the crowd is saying it is real. 
that today we have decided we don't want to see any longer Fulani in Biafra land. We, the indigenous of Biafra land, want to say, and with the leader, leading function on the order of our Supreme Leader, Martin Nandekano, we are standing here today to say every single Fulani to leave Biafra land now or forever. Every of our crop have been destroyed. They have been raping our women, killing our children, putting them on mayhem. Some are homeless now. We say today they must leave. Oh, two things involved. Thank you very much. You speak positively. As you look around, you can still see people uh, still queuing up wonderfully. And uh, I have this young man with me here with this description in his hand. If you cannot see the totality of the banner up there, you can see this. This is exactly what they have up there. And you can see the crowd that came to grace this wonderful occasion of placing a very strong banner in order to bring down the kind of killings that is going on in Biafra land. Thank you for being with us. Uh, what is your name and uh, what do you have to say? My brother is Hila uh, Abuji Chupo Kadigo. I'm very happy because we have seen a leader. I'm very much happy because I don't know what our situation will be by now. My